Hey guys, welcome to my temporary setup here. Well, I mean, it's not temporary, but it's temporarily in progress. And I'm just going to be doing my quick little, um, big unboxing that I've been trying to get done for probably six weeks at this point. I don't even know. It seems like six weeks that I've been attempting to record this. Um, I also tried to record a new update setup, uh, work in progress update thing, but I've done that like three times and just never got, never thought it was good enough to upload or just didn't get to uploading it until it was like too old to bother with, so I guess this will be both kind of combined. I'm just doing a, showing you guys what my t setup is currently looking like. Um, I'm waiting to get an L-shaped desk on Amazon that I'm going to be using in here so I can get rid of like all this junk and have like a real desk over here. It's going to be white and silver and glass, I believe. So it'll kind of go with this corner shelf over here and I've got like that round glass table and my, and my cubes that I recently set up. That was definitely an ordeal. <laughs> um, some of the cubes in it are still just temporarily, like, placeholders. Um, I do have a lot of stuff in here that I wanted in here, like my collectibles and my lights and stuff, but I'm also planning on, like, making it look better once I get enough to put in the other holes in here. The other cubes, I should say. Um, and I was also going to get a new uh, tapestry to put up. It, they're pretty cheap when you get them on Amazon custom made you can pretty much have anything printed on it so I'm, I'm going to be getting a new one done soon hopefully um yeah and so I just have this kind of set up over here I got some new neon lights I got a new um wall shelf thing to put my headphones on and as you can see I have a new uh headphone stand that kind of have a really cheap pair of wireless headphones right now because I'm waiting to be able to get better ones. Th those are only uh, 20, 20 bucks, $21, something like that. But I'm going to be getting some better ones that are like 80 bucks. Hopefully those will do for a while. I I'm looking for some good uh, sound isolating, um, noise proof, over ear comfortable headphones like the, like the, uh, ones that I, the cyberpunk ones that I had, and so hopefully I, the ones I'm looking at will be good and I can use those for a while if I can ever get them. The next thing is the desk, so hopefully I can get that soon. Um, so the headphones are like three or four on the, on, on the list of things I need, so I don't know if that will be happening anytime soon, but I don't know, we'll see. Um... I'm closer to getting my PS4 working uh, so I can play games on it. It's almost there. Hopefully soon I'll be able to get that going. I'm not sure how the recording of my gameplay is going to go right at first because I'm, I'm just having a hard enough time getting it working and getting the hang of playing it at, at, at the moment. So I don't want to like record me just horribly failing at it. <laughs> But, um, yeah, this, this annoying little animal here that has been the source of the bane of my existence for months now is my mom's cat, and she's taking him back next weekend, hopefully, so I can finally rest, I hope, and finally get stuff done, because as soon as I try to go to bed or as soon as I start recording a video, he's awake and bugging the heck out of me. So... Yeah, he's going to be helping out, apparently. Um, I opened all these curtains. There's, he's got a bed in the bedroom window to, to lay on and look out the window all day. And I opened this curtain for him to sit in the window and look out of, and he just has to be in the way, of course. Um, so yeah, I also have this floor rug that I got to cover up my hideous carpet, because it's really nasty and I'm tired of looking at it. And the rugs I did have were all mismatched and old and stained. So I just got this one to put down doing, during videos and tours and stuff like that. So it's not going to stay um, on the floor. 
it would get ruined in weeks if it stayed on the floor. Um, but yeah, this is basically what this wall is going to look like for now. And I got my pin collection. I got my cheapo TV over here. It's made by the same company as the phone I'm using to record this. TL, uh, TCL. Um, so it's a decent screen and everything. And it's got okay speakers, but I'm having a hard time connecting it to other speakers. Like, I wanted to use both of these that I got on Amazon, but um, these are Bluetooth and have uh, audio out on the top and very short audio cables with it, so I'm going to have to um, try to get one that will allow me to add both of them to my TV somehow. Not sure if that'll work, but otherwise it's only going to be hooked up to one and that's going to be kind of weird, I guess. It's mostly for looks anyway, but um, I was using one on my laptop and one on my phone, and at some point I'd like to have like my whole setup in here, my laptop and my TV and my console and everything, so hopefully soon that'll be, that'll be all um, settled once I get my desk and everything, and I'll be able to make it finish up in here, make it look better. Hopefully soon I wanted to do it before my birthday in a couple months and enter Setup Wars that I've been trying to do that for like a year and a half now. So anyway, wish me luck on that and I'm going to start cutting into my box now. I'm going to try and do a new um, format here because I don't want to actually be on camera right now. I'm a sweaty mess and I'm not dressed right now and I need a shower, but I wanted to get this done before daylight is gone and I lose my chance again because I need my chair really badly. <laughs> Like, if there's anything wrong with it, I need to be able to return it before the time is up to return it. So basically, I have to open it, and I can't keep putting it off. So I'm going to be doing a new format here. Basically, this... I shouldn't have even played music in the background, because I'm going to be pausing it in between, like... Basically, you'll see what I mean in a second. But anyway, uh, let's see how this works. Since I have no real ability to edit my videos at the moment both because of time and energy and because uh, I just don't have the software and all I have is a really old laptop, so <laughs> we're just going to try this and see how it works, okay? Uh, so yeah, I'll see you at the end of the video. Okay, just to cut in here, I, hopefully you can hear me okay. Um, I'm not using my lapel mic like I usually do on here because I'm moving around, but since the first step is to put the wheels on, um, where did I throw those things? You know, the typical wheels that you get with these shitty junk, uh, junk plastic wheels. Actually, these are slightly better than normal wheels, but than regular wheels, I should say. Um, I might actually use these on my old desk chair that I have in my dining area. Is there, I mean, I don't know. I'd have to examine the other ones. They, they are really cheap, plasticky, junky wheels that, you know, you always get with the standard um, that go with your chair. So, um, since one of the biggest complaints in the feedbacks were the wheels breaking, I went ahead and ordered a set I mean, I've never seen a bigger selection of a, just a part to something than I did when I looked for desk chair wheels. I mean, I, I spent like hours trying to find the best, the coolest looking best ones, like dirt sturdy ones that um, weren't too expensive. And I think I paid like $22 or something for these. So I got this set. They were like four and a half star rated. Um, and they're like super heavy duty rubberized wheels that I got to put on this. And so they're also good to not ruin, like leave tracks in the carpet and shit. And they're good for hardwood because they're like silicone rubber. And they're going to be a lot easier to roll around in. Um, 
they rotate really easily. So yeah, I'm looking forward to trying these out. Um, so I just wanted to show you guys that because these are the wheels I'm going to be putting on it instead of the regular ones. So if you're interested, I will also be linking the the desk chair and the or the gaming chair and the desk chair wheels in the description. So let's get back to the really poor quality um, sort of jank together MacGyver together uh, slideshow thingy I'm trying to accomplish here. Failing miserably, but let's let's get back to that. <laughs> Okay, um, I don't know if I'm ever going to post this, honestly, because, uh, <laughs> obviously this isn't working. Um, you guys probably have no idea what's going on, but I've been trying to keep my camera turned on for the last hour while I've literally been killing myself trying to get this thing together. You saw that I had it put together except for the arms. I got one arm put on, and then the other arm... <laughs> that I was trying to put on now that it's almost dark and you can't see and this camera is pissing me off because it's all blurry as fuck even though I've uh, focused it a million times uh, so yeah this that I have been trying to screw in for the past half an hour is not going in no matter how many times I've tried I've lined it up visually underneath there I've lined it up I've, had, I've, I've done it just like I did all the other ones I, um, it's crooked I don't know if you can tell it's crooked. I don't know if that has anything to do with it. But I have been trying my absolute damnedest to get this in for the last at least half an hour. And it's not going in. It, go, I, I, it goes in. I think it's in. And then when I went to move it, it just pops right back out. It doesn't go in. So <laughs> I don't even know if I have if, if I can even return it at this point. I don't know if I can return the wheels on top of it. They're going to charge me 30 bucks for a restocking fee or some shit. But after the, the problem with me trying to purchase a recliner to sleep in, which I got screwed over on, I got screwed out of 80 bucks for that, and I'm still sleeping in my broken Goodwill recliner that I got years and years ago. And I was trying to get a new recliner to sleep in because that's what I have to sleep in. I couldn't get a recliner to sleep in. <laughs> And then I wanted to get a new chair because the desk chair I have is rock hard and it's killing me and I have to sit there and do work to pay the bills, to pay for medicine, so I can keep doing this. What this is, I have no idea, existing, I guess. And I'm just getting so fucking tired of being screwed over. It doesn't matter if it was somebody. At this point, this obviously is just my shitty luck like I always have because... I don't, I'm not allowed to purchase anything without it being broken or malfunctioned or I have to immediately return it or whatever. I'm never allowed to just buy something that I want or need that I get in one piece. It works right. I'm happy with it. I get to keep it. I get to use it and whatever. I don't, I've never had that. I don't remember ever having that. This phone that I just got to use, it was supposed to be my regular phone and my video phone is not going to work now because I can't switch to boost. I can't switch as far as I know after the auction I purchased it on said that it was open for all carriers. I can only use it on Verizon or T-Mobile, which I don't have here, which I can't use here, which I can't get Verizon because they don't have um, a prepaid service here. So as far as I know, on top of the camera being a severe problem, this is ridiculous. Like, I'm never going to get the money back that I paid for this phone. I'm, I, I highly doubt I'll be able to return this chair, but I'm calling Amazon tomorrow and telling them that I need a refund for this because at this point I need to buy a chair that is going to work and I don't have the money for that until I get the money back from this. And this is ridiculous. I, I, I just got done spending like three hours trying to record a video of making this, putting this chair together and now it's ruined again. 
again, of course it is. I probably won't even upload this, just like the last four videos I recorded. Because not only is this bullshit, and it's a shitty video now, but nobody cares anyway. So why am I even doing this? Like, I'm killing myself trying to get a setup going, and trying to get my... my set up done so I can be happy and sit there and be comfortable and have my working computer and my working TV and my working PlayStation and that's apparently too much to ask because my computer never works right and my PlayStation hasn't I haven't been able to use that since I got it not one not not at all you know I played like 15 minutes of Last of Us and I can't get Cyberpunk to work and I can't use it and whatever and 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 it's just like Every single thing I try to do or try to purchase, I get I, I just have the worst luck. And I can't afford this anymore. Like physically, mentally, financially, I can't afford this anymore. This hoodie, by the way, that I was so excited to get, because I had it on my wish list for a long time, and I got it on Amazon, and I ordered the highest, the biggest size they had because it was from China, so it's like really small sizes. And even though I got the biggest size they had... It's too small for me to put on. It's I can't put it on. The armpits are too small. I can't zip it up. So you know, like I, I, I don't. I give up. I give up. I give up. I don't know what to do anymore. I give up. I am just. I have been so at the end of my rope for so long at this point, and I was trying to get this chair put together as quickly as possible. Because I have another typing job to do tonight or tomorrow night. And I can't do it in this fucking chair that I have now. And now I don't even have this. Whatever this is. I don't know if they're going to make me return it. There's, I'm not paying, you know, a third of the cost to return it. So they better not screw me on this. Because I have been paying for Amazon Prime for years. Just so I could get, you know, the stuff I need quickly and with free shipping and be able to return it if I need to. Which, given my luck, I need to all the time. So it's worth paying $12 a month to be able to do that. But, like, <laughs> this is this is bullshit. I paid 30 bucks for the wheels. I paid 125 bucks, 30 bucks for the chair. And now I ain't got anything to show for it. And this... This, I, I just can't do this anymore. Like, I am so exhausted from trying to get this setup done and trying to get to where I can finally be done and just relax and enjoy it. And clearly, that's never going to happen. I'm just so t tired of this. Like, why can't I just catch a fucking break for once? You know, be able to get a nice camera phone. Like, you know... God forbid I'd be able to get one of the newer ones. Like, on my list, all I had was, like, maybe the Pixel 4 or the 4. I like the bigger screen, so bigger screen ones. Or I don't even remember what I had on my fucking list. But, like, the S10 or, or the Note 10, those, you know, were on my list, which doesn't mean anything because I can never afford those. But, like, my my dream phone was the, the OnePlus 7T Pro, the McLaren one, but I was only looking at, like, broken ones because those were the only ones I could afford and that wasn't going to really work for me, so I don't know what, at, at this point, like, what I'm going to do about my phone, what I'm going to do, because my regular phone that I use for communication and shit is, is pretty much almost dead. I keep getting more and more problems with it all the time. And I was supposed to have switched by now, and I can't because this one's not going to work, and I have to find another one or, you know, be able to come up with 90 bucks to get one through uh, Straight Talk or something. So I don't know what I'm going to do at this point. I need a shower. I have to take my mom's cat to the vet tomorrow. And I have typing to do this weekend in my shitty rock-hard chair. So that's great. I guess I'm done complaining if nobody's, I'm not even going to be posting this, so whatever. I guess I'll try again when I, if I ever get another chair. This, I'm, I'm, I don't know what to do at this point. I'm calling Amazon tomorrow, that's all I can do. And I better get my money back for this shit. Peace out.